Uh, dear students, uh, in this module we are going to talk about the uh, the term uh, uh, the etymology of uh, the term society. The usage of the term society can be traced back to the mid 16th century. Uh, it actually came from the word société. It's a it's a French word uh, in in the English literature. Société uh, that was uh, meant to be the companions or the companionship or the uh, association of uh, uh, number of people. So, this ko thoda sa agar hum dekhe to historically it evolved. This ka jo meaning hai, wo uh, simplicity se complexity ki taraf evolve hua. Uh, like in the 18th century, the usage was to describe merely the upper class or the high society, and uh, then the like-minded people or the society of friends. But by the passage of time, the meanings became much more complicated, much more complex. Uh, especially jab uh, uh, isko specifically different disciplines ke under use uh, iska usage shuru hua. For example, uh, uh, during the 18th century or the late 18th century, uh, when the term social physics was coined, the term uh, society was not being used in in that complex sense, which is being used in the in the modern. Uh, sociological literature uh, like the uh, its general and abstract definition uh, became uh, much more firmly established in during the late 18th century uh, merely from companionship to the uh, complexity uh, to much more complexity like including uh, the, the groups or the number of people which could have the common culture and then sociological meaning was firmly or uh, specifically was developed during the 19th century uh, which later on was uh, converted into much more uh, complicated terminology itself so uh, keeping in view uh, this uh, historical trace and uh, uh, and the complexity uh, when we come to the 20th century, the earlier discussion of the societies between the first word, second word, and third word, we are uh, currently uh, viewing it uh, in 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 the different segments uh, which are being uh, devised or which are being uh, associated uh, with the um, with the economic positions as well as the uh, prestige, the social prestige, uh, and the societies. Uh, overall structure so is ko jab hum dekhte hain first word societies hain second word societies hain third word societies hain to usme jo unki wealth hai ya economic well being hai economic prosperity hai uska ek bada amal dakhal hota hai agle modules ke andar ja ke hum iski jo complexities hain iske jo characteristics hain hum unko discuss karenge abhi jo current discussion hai usme aap dekhenge ke jo this term ki jo usage hai wo developed word or underdeveloped word ke andar jo hai wo badi distinctively use ho rahi hai very frequently use ho rahi hai so uh, later on we will find uh, that how those distinctions become much more important for the sociological literature 